Environmental laws have existed since the 6th century in ancient Rome and have multiplied in recent years. Yet despite the growing concern about the state of our environment, our planet's health continues to decline. Under the current global legal system, humans mostly view nature as a resource and property, existing only for human benefit. This gives the owner the right to exploit nature, resulting in the current global environmental crisis. We need a solution that levels the playing field by addressing the root cause. When humans and corporations have rights, but nature does not, nature inevitably suffers. Earth law recognizes that humans and nature are intimately connected and calls on us to manage our activities in a way that benefits the Earth as a whole. Adopting Earth-based laws change the status of nature from a resource and property to a rights-bearing entity, with those rights enforceable by people, governments, and communities. Ecuador, Bolivia, and Mexico City have amended their constitutions to incorporate the rights of nature. New Zealand gave legal rights and identity to the world's first river and national park. And 43 municipalities in the United States also protect the rights of ecosystems and species, including Santa Monica. Earth needs us to transform our laws and policies to recognize that nature has inherent rights to live, thrive, and evolve. It's our responsibility to protect those rights both now and for future generations.